Good morning. How are we doing today? I hope we're all doing great. I woke up, I slept in today. So it's like 9.30. This video is sponsored by Care Of, so I'm really excited to be working with them and show you guys their products. Um, I've worked with them in the past and you guys have loved it and I've been using their products ever since, so I'm really excited for this collaboration. But yeah, I'm gonna do a full day of eating today. I haven't done like a what I eat in a day in a really long time. My what I eat in a day are either foods I've already showed before because I'm such a creature of habit, but I think a lot of people are. Just remember that I'm not offering any dietitian tips, dietary tips advice, anything like that. I'm literally showing you guys what I eat in a day. Um, and I have no goals with my body right now. I'm not trying to lose weight. I'm not trying to bulk. I'm not trying to cut. I'm not trying to literally do anything. Um, obviously with what's going on, I'm just trying to feed my body and, um, keep it healthy and running and happy. I intuitively eat. I don't follow a diet and I just live. So yeah, it doesn't have to be that deep. So here we go. Let's get on to it. Um, obviously with everything going on in the world, it's just not really normal right now. So I feel like there's so much pressure of doing like at home workouts or like losing weight during quarantine. And like, look, I love at home workouts. Obviously I've been doing them. My, my business stride, we provide them for people. But, um, with that being said, I don't think that like you need to be doing like crazy stuff during quarantine. I think that just like being intuitive and eating healthy during it and just making sure that you're doing what feels good for your body is the best thing that you can possibly do, be doing during this time. I don't think it's like the time to go crazy or do anything like drastic, like a new diet. Like you don't have to be doing that stuff. And um, if you feel like you do have to be, you don't have to be. If you are, that's awesome and like great for you. That's really, really great. But like if you're not, don't feel like you have to be. I know eat, watching these like during quarantine kind of suck because so many people are like, oh my God, I'm like, Doing the best I've ever been and it's like <laughs> it doesn't have to be like that so I'm gonna show you guys what I eat today the supplements I take everything like that um, on a daily basis first things first is coffee one thing that I got really into this quarantine is coffee and I'm literally so happy about it so while my coffee is being made this is typically when I will take um, my vitamins and supplements for the day so I've been really focusing on gut health for years now you guys know that you know me and gut health whatever um and then the other thing is my hair i've been trying to grow out my hair i took out my extensions if you guys listen to my podcast episode about it i took out my extensions in um march like march 1st i got them taken out and yeah i've just been trying to grow my hair as long thick healthy as possible since um so this is just my natural hair obviously i haven't got my hair done um so this is all growth and natural i'm actually really loving it um, I'm loving the rootage. Yeah, this is just natural. I just showered last night and then I slept and this is how my hair is when I wake up. Um, so anyway, I kind of went to bed with it wet. I feel like that helps like get it wavy. But anyway, not the point. The point is my vitamins um, from Care Of are curated to me for hair and digestion. That's my coffee being made. Literally the best sound ever. So mine are really for hair and digestion. Um, the vitamin aisle is really confusing and there's a ton of information out there of like what supplements to take So care of makes it really really easy. So what you do is you go online and you take a quiz It's like five minutes. It's actually really fun because you get to pick out like what your mood is every day What your stress levels are if you have any dietary preferences um, What your goals are and then once you tell them what your goals are they're like dive deeper into it Just pretty much just being like what goals do you want for your hair and then same with my gut and stuff like that So it's really cool and it's really curated to you um, It shows up on your doorstep a couple days later in this really cute box and then it has individually packaged vitamins and they say your name on them um, so mine obviously says hi Tori um, which is super cute and yeah this is all of your vitamins and once you're done the quiz it will like tell you what all the vitamins are that you're getting and what they do um, so yeah these are mine and care of packs uh, like these packs use compostable material so they're eco-friendly which is super awesome you can read out more about it on their website it's really cool to dig into but it's nice so it's eco-friendly hi guys me editing um really quick so because of everything going on in the world um for right now uh care of is going to be not doing their customizable um, individual packaging because they have a small team in Brooklyn. The daily vitamin packs will be back really, really soon. Um, and their supplements are just going to be shipping in bottles. So that's the only little change. Um, but other than that, let's get back to what I was saying. Normally, I don't talk when my coffee's being made. So I typically can do this all in one fair swoop. My coffee's done. Um, I just use black coffee. Cheers to vitamins, everybody. If you guys go to TakeCareOf.com and enter code TORYD50, you get 50% off your first order. For my coffee, hot coffee, and Mia's going to bring me iced coffee too when she comes over in a little bit, which is going to be awesome. So just coffee and oat milk. The blue Oatly oat milk is 
the best. And then some cinnamon. And that's how I do it. That's it. Cheers, guys. So typically with my first cup of coffee, I read um, a book on my iPad. Right now I'm reading The Beach Club. I'm loving it so far. Um, so I'll read. And then when my first cup of coffee is done, I'll typically like finish up a chapter or finish up a section. And then I'll make a second cup of coffee and then I'll sit down and plan my day on my laptop. From then I kind of just do as I please with food. So that's typically like my routine in the morning. I just wrote my to-do list for the day. You can't really see it. Um, but I use my iPad for my to-do list and I just use an Apple Pencil, best thing ever. Mia came over and did merch and she brought me Dunkin'. Uh, I just get an iced coffee with almond milk from Dunkin'. Okay, it's noon and I'm hungry. Um, I haven't eaten yet today. Pretty late in the day for me, but I also woke up pretty late in the day, so I guess it's fine. Um, I don't know what I'm in the mood for. I kind of want oatmeal. I kind of want avocado toast. I think I'll do oatmeal. Oh, also, I'm going to Sea Isle today, so um, you guys will see like what I, I don't even know what I'm going to eat down there. I literally have no idea. But a bunch of restaurants are opening today because it's today's Thursday, which is makes it like Memorial Day weekend. So a lot of places are opening up, which is great. But I'm gonna make oatmeal. I make my oatmeal the same every single day. That's breakfast. Again, doesn't look pretty, but oats. Frozen blueberries, lava, I don't know how, if that's how you say it, plant-based yogurt, craisins, peanut butter. Oh my God, it's my favorite breakfast. Hey guys, still made. Uh, it's two o'clock now and I'm gonna eat some lunch. Um, I'm not that hungry because I haven't been as like active in quarantine, obviously, so I'm just not eating as much as normal, but I think I'm gonna do avocado toast i wanted that for breakfast but i opted for oatmeal so i think i'm gonna do avocado toast now this that i'm making is exactly the snack that i had every single day in high school my senior year of high school I'm sure we all know how this works by now i love avocado toast on sourdough bread but i haven't been to trader joe's in a while so i haven't been able to get it Pink himalayan sea salt yum balsamic glaze the best Everything but the bagel seasoning, fire, but again, haven't been to Trader Joe's, so I'm out of that. Okay, avo toast and a banana. This is like a lunch slash snack. I'm not super hungry and this will do the trick. I just got to Sea Isle and I'm starving. My camera's in the car, so I'm gonna use my phone right now, but I'm just eating some fruit that I found in the fridge. Carrots. Hummus. Sorry if that bothered anybody. Yeah. Like I was saying on my phone, I'm at the beach now. I uh, got here pretty quick. I ate fruit. And now I'm eating carrots and hummus. And it's not focusing. Okay. And my mom's making a stir fry for me, which is gonna be great. Yeah, life is good. Would you look at this? Stir fry, brown rice stir fry with kale, pepper, Brussels, carrots, yum. Onion, brown rice, yum. Alrighty, now it's eight and I'm craving like sweet but peanut butter. Um, and I really wanted a bowl of oatmeal again, but I was like, no, I already had it this morning so I shouldn't have it twice. I mean, I can, but I just don't really want to. I mean, I do want to, but I was like, you could do better. Offer some variety to your dietary. So I made peanut butter and jelly on rice cakes. I have peanut butter and jelly every single day. It's literally my favorite food. I have it all the time. Um, yeah, so this is what I eat. I eat very carb heavy, big carb girl. Um, I love it. I normally do it when I work out a lot, I eat a lot of carbs, it keeps me fueled. 
and it's just what my body likes. I feel like my body responds really well to carbs. And then I'm just gonna watch a movie. Do something on my iPad. Either read, movie, or emails. And that's where my full day of eating ends. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. Um, yeah, just remember to stay healthy, do what you can during this quarantine. And um, yeah, just listen to your body, honor your body, and do what you can. Don't stress out too much. Uh, be sure to check out Care Up. Thank you guys again for sponsoring this video. I'll have everything linked down below. Use code TORYD for 50% off your first order from Care Up. And yeah, I'll talk to you guys all in my next video. Bye guys.